Hey guys, what's up? My name is Akusia. If you're seeing me for the very first time and you're welcome to another weekly vlog. If you're new, you're welcome, okay? Let me do my intro well. That's how my intro. Let me do it well. Let me do it well. Hey guys, what's up? My name is Akusia. If you're new, if you're a returning subscriber, hey boo, what do you do? Okay, period. Now that's, that's an intro. <laughs> but good morning, you guys. Happy Wednesday. It's 25th October, Wednesday. I'm currently at work but I thought I would open up the vlog I think I sort of opened up the vlog on Monday I think I did but I didn't do an intro and I'm trying to do better at doing intros for my vlog so that's just what it is but happy new week you're welcome to another weekly vlog so this week I have a lot of um, I have quite a number of adulting things to do you know like filling forms and stuff like that so <laughs> i'm gonna be doing that and then i also have some new fixtures i have a new light fixture for the living room so we'll put that together and if i press boards finally came and here literally the whole station area came for the you know homeschool station that i wanted to set up for her so we'll also do that in this vlog and then i will certainly cook with you because i love to cook with you guys and i think that's pretty much what um this week's vlog is going to be about i don't really have any plans this weekend i'm thinking i don't know but i have to text Jax. but i want to film a video with Jax because the first time we had filmed a video it didn't go so well so but i have to text her just to make sure that we both have the time for it but either way this week is going to be a chilled weekly vlog as per usual i don't know if my vlogs are chill but you got the vibe <laughs> but you guys i just wanted to talk about my hair okay like i just this a quick you know we always have hair talks let's just talk about it one second because i'm a hair girly so i like to talk about my hair but my question right now is my hair is still natural okay this is the blow dry state sort of like the straightened state now it freezes up really quickly because i work out i work out every morning five days a week so i've realized that it's not something that i can maintain i mean if i have to maintain it it means that i have to blow dry my hair every day or maybe every other day which is quite quite a lot for me if i'm being completely honest and so i don't know and the lady was advising that i leave my hair out um she was advising that i don't do so much wigs i just leave my hair to breathe but my hair right now i have to blow dry it for it to look cute i'm not even going to lie like let me just say that it's okay if you don't like something about you and that's me i don't like my hair that's just the tall and shots I think I've come to a stage where I've come to realize that my hair is just a disservice right now. So like a disservice per se, that's a bit of a big word, but it's like, I don't know, like, I feel like I don't want to stress about my hair. I would rather just have short hair and have my peace of mind. Do you know what I'm saying? Because my hair is such a stress factor for me. I feel like if I'm not dealing with my hair so much, I might not be stressing about a lot of like things. I don't know. But yeah, that's it's i mean my hair looks good don't get me wrong i love my new haircut but just the idea of maintaining my hair with heat every week is like a lot for me because my hair is natural and the main reason why i went to you know trim my ends was because of heat damage so i don't want to like go back to heat damage because that's what i'm trying to prevent so at this point i don't know i might still end up putting it under wigs because Wigs is a much easier option for me, I'm not gonna lie. Enough of the hair talks, that's a little hair rant for the week because you guys know that's pretty much the only thing that I rant about. It's like my hair every time. It's such a problem for me because I can't wait for it to grow. I am currently taking some biotin. I really didn't want to talk about it. I just wanted to like finish it to see and I will give you guys updates once that is done. Um, but i'm currently taking that so hopefully that makes some sort of difference in my hair because i am tired i can't wait for my hair to look the best so i can you know have fun with my hair but happy wednesday you're welcome to the vlog i hope you're doing good i hope you and yours are doing amazing this is like my week check-in weekly check-in with you guys i hope you're fine i feel well okay me and my family we're fine we're grateful for life and i'm gonna get into work and i will see you guys later okay hey guys so i'm back home tell me why i forgot to vlog 
when I was going to do the grocery, I only remember it when I was at checkout. Like, I'm ashamed. I'm like, what? I only remembered when I had finished buying everything, but I didn't buy a lot of things anyway. It's seven o'clock. I have to cook dinner. I have to finish eating before it's 9 p.m. So I will see you guys in a little. I look a little scruffy. I'm not going to lie. I will see you guys later. Okay, give me one second. Let me cook, figure out my life, and then I'll see you guys a little later. Time I think you're gonna walk out of my door I start to jump to the conclusion You don't love me no more Babe, give me something to work with Can you just reassure me? Hey you guys, good morning. I hope you guys can hear me. Let me take you up a little. But happy Thursday morning. I have just finished doing my workout. It's a little early in the morning. When it's so early, I don't like talking too much. Like, I don't like talking loudly. Honestly, because my front is there and I don't want her to wake up. So, I mean, I don't want her to wake up early. So, I'm about to do some hair mask, okay? Yesterday, I was having a little hair breakdown. I'm not even gonna lie. I just didn't like talk to you guys so much but i was having a little hair breakdown and i was saying that i feel like my hair is shedding a lot more or it's just like it's going back that's the tall and short because in the, in the beginning it was just like here like this whole area was gone but now for whatever reason i have balding in this entire area and you guys can see that like this whole area is also getting bald and i don't know what i've done wrong like i've been doing everything right with my hair you guys know like me have to me i know that like i'm always like trying to change my hairstyles and whatnot but that's just because i love my hair i love to look good with like a hairdo it's just who i am i love like hair but i have been like religiously washing my hair doing my conditioners you know trying to be very gentle on my edges doing less braids i haven't done i've done i did braids like almost a month or two ago and so i have been doing everything that i'm supposed to be doing i've been using my oils i've been drinking my biotin my topicals like everything that a child is supposed to be doing a girl is doing it but it's not it's not working it is not working this area is also balding i don't know if it's because whenever i pat my hair i pat it like that i feel like that's the reason why because whenever i'm patting my hair this is how i pat my hair <laughs> so i feel like it even gives a room for this area to open up a lot more my hair is like shedding crazy at this point it's insane and they keep saying that i have to leave my hair you know i just have to leave my hair for it to do its own thing and like grow because she is just at the stage where she can't take pressure but i'm like what should i do like when it wakes is okay but it's stressful because then you have to take off the glue but that's i guess that's all i can do right now that's legit all i can do slap keep slapping these wigs on my head because my own hair she's not doing it she is not doing it like she's not even ready to comply and it's just so sad like i'm honestly very sad about this that i thought i was doing well with my hair i thought my hair was you know on the journey of about to being healthy 
but it is clearly deteriorating it's not doing what it's supposed to do um i mean i'm actually very happy that i've come to a stage in my life where i'm able to actually share these things with you because initially i would have been hiding okay this would literally be in hiding because i'm like how can i show this to the world but i've come to realize that it's actually a situation that a lot of women go through losing their hair a lot of women are battling with hair loss in the perimeters and i don't know why especially a lot of african women um i really don't know why i've tried a lot of products i am tired everybody keeps rec recommending something that i should try so please don't do it because i've tried i've tried everything everything under the sun that you can think of i have all the oils jamaica rosemary like everything that you can think of i'm tired i am just tired and i don't know i give up I, I don't want to say that i give up on my hair but i really do give up i'm gonna do some hair mask i have mixed some avocado and um honey let me actually throw some oil into this because black hair thrives with oil so i'm just gonna mix in some jamaican black castor oil and i'm just gonna put this in my hair sit for about 30 minutes i'm doing this because i'm about to put my hair back in wigs i already i just said it because i can't do it like i can't finesse this shit i'm a content creator i would love to you know do my contents with my natural hair and you know just show you guys natural hairstyles just like fun stuff but i can't do it i can't even fake it like i can't even come and stand here and lie and act like oh yeah i can i can show it to you guys oh yeah flaunt your hair if it's broken in the front like no <laughs> i can't do it i'm just gonna let you know i cannot do it like my hair is damaged and so i'm gonna shove hair away till i know what i want to do with it you know the thing where you like fake it till you make it i can't do it with my hair i can't fake it till i make it with my hair so let's see you guys had it here first okay i'm tired of my hair if you don't ever see my hair again that's because she's she's over and out i'm tired of hair. <laughs> i'm tired anyway you guys i am gonna go sit with this hair mask for about 30 to 45 minutes and then i'm gonna come shower and just do the rest of my day i can't wait to slap on a wig and forget my hair if it's a crap my shit hey daddy lumba say on say that we say do me a seema open gate then go open gate I am finally at work. Let me just say that that was a good morning routine, but that's literally my morning routine. I pair music with everything that I do these days. I am building the habits of trying to find the joy in the little things that I do because, you know, as a person or just, you know, I think most especially as a mom, you tend to do so much like i have this job and then i have all the things that i do around the house and then i have a fitness lifestyle which i have to um you know it's a lifestyle for me because at this point in my life i'm like how would i survive if i'm not taking care of myself so at this point i need to be able to give myself that structure and sometimes doing all these things can feel so repetitive and it can make you stressed out or it can make you feel like it's not fun but i've realized that pairing music if you're a type that loves music mommy budget if you're the type that loves music then it makes it a lot more easier for you because i love music okay music with everything just brings my soul up so music on a normal day makes me excited so i realized that pairing music with all these things that i do on a daily can make me even more um happier or can make me less stressed out which i've realized that is working because now when i'm showering i have music when i'm cooking i have music or i have some little you know vlog or something that i'm watching but i pair all these like everyday tasks with the things the joyful things that i love to do like listen to music or listen to a podcast i would pair it with these things and i've come to realize that it makes it a lot more easier for me to go through the day 
sometimes I talk with my tongue, go through the day without feeling so stressed out. So that's what I've been doing and my morning routines have just been the best. Now, Inframapa doesn't wake up till literally after my morning routine. She wakes up at around like 8.30. So even if she doesn't wake up, I have given her a routine. So right now, I wake her up at 8.30 because I have to be at work at 9.30. And I don't want her, initially what I would do is I'll just leave her for her to sleep. And then when she wakes up, I would have to like be rushing and, you know, be stealing time here and there to shower and doing all these things. But I found out that it was too stressful. So I have given her structure. I wake her up at 8.30, give her a shower, prep her food and everything. By 9, we're usually done. And then I'm seated at my desk and then I'm feeding her. She's not so good at feeding herself right now. We're still trying to practice that. But that is kind of like the morning routine and it's working so well for me i'm able to wake up work out do my self-care routine spend some morning time you know just some chill time and then i get into work oh my camera is going off because my battery is low but i will let you guys go for right now what i'm about to do is i'm about to prep my wig that's what I do because I work from home. I'm grateful um, that I'm able to like do other stuff on the side. So I'm about to like work on my wig while working. <laughs> if I need to like attend to like stuff, I do that. But currently I'm about to just like straighten this wig and prep it and put it on. So yeah, we'll do that. Happy Thursday, 26th. I hope you have a good day and I'll see you guys when I close from work. Okay. Good morning you guys happy friday i've done my morning routine i did my workout i did all of that i'm about to take off my hair i just wanted to take it down with you i'm getting ready to go um to work it's currently 8 30 so i have about an hour more to go tell me why in did not sleep last night i don't know why <laughs> like i need you guys to legit tell me why this child decided not to sleep last night she just she just wasn't having it she just kept like trying to sleep and then she'll wake up and then she'll cry and then she'll sleep again it was just so stressful and you know i i gave her food i changed her diaper all with hopes that she was going to sleep you know what time she slept she slept finally at like 5 30 a.m and i'm like wow 
wow when she sleeps at 5 30 there's no way i can really sleep because 5 30 for me is like i'm getting ready to wake up because i wake up at like six i i work out at six i finish my workout at least at 6 30 sometimes 6 45 so i just couldn't go back to sleep i ended up watching a few videos and then she she finally slept but the good thing is i'm not even tired originally on days like that i would wake up feeling so tired and just so exhausted because you know i didn't get enough sleep but i feel good i woke up i did my morning workout i did a full body hit hit workout i'm also filming what i eat in a day today for you guys because i just want to share that with you i have i have one person that asked me to film my um workout routine for the whole week so next week i'll film that for this one person that asked for it i'm filming on what i eat in a day um on intermittent fasting because next month i'm gonna be bulking and eating so i'm not actually going to be fasting so i feel like this is the best time i hope you guys can really hear me because i'm not talking so loud but my microphone she's loud so she should do the job right i love doing these curls okay this overnight curl situation they work so well for me and the curls last all day like i say it on my instagram stories every time the curls last all day like all day so i'm just currently trying to like relay my wig not entirely like relayed but just like lay the sides because they started lifting when i was working out um so i'm just gonna lay that but it's friday i feel nice and cute i have on some cute loungewear i'm just gonna wear that for today it's warm oh my goodness you guys yesterday was so warm and i looked at the weather for this weekend and saturday is a beautiful warm day so saturday we just might go outside okay we just might go outside for a second because it's a nice and warm day i'm finding i'm trying to find more activities that i can do with in front of our outside because where we live is like very shut out or like shut off from the world it's a very like small town type of situation so there's not so many activities to do for kids but what i could do is invite my um, little nieces and have them come over for the weekend i think that should be fun so that they can play but also i'm not gonna lie having a lot of kids around they wear me out <sighs> kids are a lot okay so shout outs to all you moms that have you know four five toddlers at home because oh i don't know how you do it but hats off for you okay my hats off to you <laughs> um but yeah so i might bring them over so we do the puzzles that i have and then yeah i don't know but this weekend will just be a chill weekend i'm thinking of working in the garden it will be nice it'll be chill it'll be chill <laughs> but i am gonna go edit right now while this wig is still trying to lay i have an episode of bed with ben Hene that is coming up today on friday so yeah i'm gonna go finish that that's almost done i started editing yesterday so i'm just gonna wrap it up and then upload it and then um i did a to-do list for myself today because I told you guys that I'm trying to put myself back in routines and I've been doing that. I've been on track with my morning routine. I've been on track with my five days a week workout. Um, so, you know, I like that for me. So um, I'm building daily to-do lists. Initially, what I would do is a weekend to-do list for my content creation. But now I want to actually build a daily to-do list, even though I actually work a nine to five job you know but like because i work from home i'm able to do other stuff so i want to be more productive i want to push myself so that i can be the best version of myself so i am gonna um go according to my to-do list is going well so far but i'm gonna go into my day i hope you guys have a good friday i think i will see you when i see you i don't know but i will see you when i see you and um yeah i hope you have a good day all right
setting up the lights in the living room my husband was on the phone so I couldn't really talk to you guys while I was building the light but the light looks so cute okay um, what we're doing yes ma'am what we're doing right now is trying to like redecorate the living room because in all honesty we haven't had the yes my love yes my love in all honesty we haven't had the time to decorate the living room yes <laughs> yes. We you're picking your nose on camera. <laughs> okay, it's fine. <laughs> so we are trying to redecorate the living room because I'm not gonna lie, we've been living here for a long time, but we haven't actually decorated our living room. We've, you know, we have a couch, you know, we have the bare minimum that needs, well, I mean, that everybody needs in the living room, but we haven't actually put time into like decor or like, you know, special pieces for the place. So I feel like this is the time for that. Um, so I'm gonna be focusing more on the living room in the next few vlogs. You guys will definitely see. Um, a few more things for the living room, but the light looks amazing. I'm about to end of the vlog But before you guys go I have one last thing that I want to show you because the Amazon delivered it today So let me just quickly show you. Okay. Mm. <laughs> I Have a candle lamp warmer and I don't know if you guys have noticed but I have um, I, I was on YouTube today trying to like reset my camera because I Needed to do something about my camera because I feel like I haven't used my camera to its fullest potential so i did that i, I played around with some settings today um comment below let me know if you like the video because it's a lot lots better i'm not even going to lie like lightning everything looks way better so comment below if you like it too because i do but i got a candle warmer and you know i heard from the girls okay if you're trying to save some candles say you have a luxury candle that you don't want to burn or if you're not into actually burning candles you can get a candle warmer it gives you sort of like the same effect it warms the candle gives you the fragrance from the candle but then still preserves the candle i guess i'm excited to try this out because i've seen a lot of girls talk about it and then i'm like you know let me grab one so i did so let me see this particular one is really cute Oh, this one is so cute, you guys. Like, this is so pretty, right? This is what it looks like. Oh, this is so pretty. Like, this is entirely too cute. Like, you place the candle here, and then it just warms it up for you. So, it comes with two bulbs. So, I'm just going to go ahead and put one. What I'm thinking of putting it in the living room. Initially, I wanted to put this in the bedroom, but honestly, the bedroom, I just sleep there, wake up, come downstairs, and I don't go there again till I'm going back to bed. So I don't know. I might put this in the living room. But also, because I the one that I have is a lamp, the whole lamp shed, I don't know if, I mean, like, because I just installed a lamp in the living room, 
I don't know if I want this, but I also know that I want a candle in the living room. So I might still put this there. I'm gonna go put this in the living room. So, if my papa is being a big baby, but I'm gonna have to end up the vlog here. Thank you guys so much. I don't know how much footage I have this week, I'm not gonna lie. But whatever footage I have, I'm gonna go with it, okay? So, I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys in next week's vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to check out Bed with Ben Hine. I do have another episode that is out. It came up yesterday. So be sure to check that out. But thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.